Let me. Well, I don't have a beep. fire alarm in my room. You hear oh. the beep. I can't beep beep, so I, have plus, so I, I, I broke it. I'm so used to it, it might be me. <clears throat> Pay attention. You're a psycho. You it's been happening for like three years. So, you know, three you years? Just, buy, just buy a battery! Yeah, <laughs> I fucking, we have like eight of them. And like randomly one goes off like every fucking hour. Or to like five, ten, I'm just used to it. Alright, welcome to another round of Game Gear Jeopardy. Uh, with me today we have Kyle. Oh, hi. Brian. Hello. Yeah, Martine. You know what it is, check it out. <laughs> <laughs> and we have all Ben. Right, oh, um. Alright, so you all know there was a Jeopardy, I'm not even gonna waste my time. Alright, so. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Yes. Luis just got in. Oh, oh he's late. Okay. Uh oh. Oh, okay. Okay, let's look at Luis too. Just because he has curly hair, you can't tell me. Oh, Peter, are you sharing your screen? Uh, I am not sharing my screen yet. Uh, sharing my screen now. The serving size of these pretzels is 32 pretzels. That just seems like a lot of pretzels. By the way, hello everyone. <laughs> Do you want 32 pretzels, Luis? Uh, are they like chocolate covered or anything like that? No, they're just pretzels. <laughs> you don't like pretzels? He doesn't like uh, non-chocolate covered pretzel. I, I, I could eat like a pretzel. I could maybe eat like two or three pretzels. After that, like, I don't know. My mouth starts getting dry. It just. But could know. you eat real pretzels though? Hey, those are the best. Like, I can eat like two of those. I like pretzels. Cause, cause Martine showed me. I, I told Martine I didn't like pretzels, and then Martine was like, Brian, 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 try a real pretzel from like Aunt, Auntie Anne's or something like. Oh, those I have a friend who lives what? in Germany. Right, he sure. likes to rub it in my face how good the food is that he can get there. Okay, so I feel like I just like kind of like pulled the stage from, from Peter. No, you're, 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 fine. you're fine. You're fine. Okay. This is content. Um, mm -hmm. so you're going from left to right. Uh, revival spell. These are all cards. These are all spell cards, I believe. Don't call me on that. These are all cards that special summon monsters from the graveyard. You just watch. Call the haunted in there. Um, Hoban, these are all cards that let you draw exactly one card. Oh my god. Uh, and Hoban. I'm, I think I misunderstand, the, I don't understand the reference. Uh, because, yeah. Upstart. Upstart God was popularized in the TCG thanks to a man named Patrick Hoban. Okay. So so what is your point? You know the like point question is Upstart, right? <laughs> like, without a doubt. I'm just gonna buzz in right now, call it. Uh, mm -hmm. E Pluribus Unum, I'm going to give you three cards You have that all belong to an archetype. You have to tell me it's archetype. Uh, irrational Numbers, I'm going to give you a number monster. You have to tell me it's number C. Uh, I like oh, I swear name. to God. Yes. Mm -hmm. so I'll, I will oh, give sorry, you I'll sorry. give you the number so you, can, so you don't have to, you know, you don't have to guess the number. But you have to give like me the full just name. the number, or are we given like the name to? I'm giving card? you the I'm giving you the full name of the card. Okay. So I'll give you something like oh number thirty nine Utopia, or I'll give you like you're number, two. I don't know, like number one hundred seven Galaxy Attack on Dragon. I can't I can't play really. I'm just at work still. I'm just I'm just finishing my side work. Right. Time to go, Brian. Uh, I drop. Also, yeah, shout, us, uh, shout us to Brian who uh, who played in the remote to YCS. 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 Yeah. YCS. Yeah. I think it was two, one, three. Yeah, wait, you got three ties? What? No, isn't the middle number no, the tie? Game lost tie. No, it's game, it's one lost tie. Oh, my bad. It's two, three, one then. Uh, no, no, yeah. you, say, you say X3 drop. That's, that's what all the people uh, yeah. play. So you lost to invoke? I tied, I lost to invoke, I tied with another invoked. I lost to a Sky Striker, and I lost to... Swordsel. Swordsel, yeah. Yeah. Hey, I told Dude. you Sky Striker is a deck. What? Yo, Sky I, beat, well, I already beat one Sky Striker, alright? So was he good? I thought he was fine. Read the chat. <laughs> alright, anyway. Uh, Lost in Transition. These are all cards with effects that are different in the anime. Or different in the manga or anime or there's original source material. Source material. Original okay. source material. Martin, you left the room. Um and the oh. last one, old fashioned. These are all monsters that cannot be special summoned. Interesting. The 
all in their text. They all have cannot be special summoned. Okay. Martin, you got the Cosmo Buzzer. Where are you? It says I'm still here. Man. Yeah, you have to refresh it. Yeah, so that's a half. Uh, so Ben, you are our returning champion. The board is yours. Uh, that seems a bit unfair. Yeah, why is Ben always supposed to go first? No. Because I, I always win. Because oh I don't think so He's just built. <laughs> Oh my god. Uh, um, let's do old fashioned for 300. Oh my god. Of the three prize card Dark Lords, this is the only one that cannot be special summoned at all. Let's start with the guy Dark Lord prize cards. Highest card Dark Lords. There yeah, I think you get them. them. They, they like, they like re release them. What? Like, like, you can go like, get... like the only one I don't know. Damn it! What, the not weird sure I know at all. Which these are? I'm also I can't be. Ah, no, I'm sorry. Brian, is it Dark Lord Asmodeus? That is incorrect. Okay. What? Uh, what's the question? Uh, is Dark Lord Desire? That is correct. Wait, what? what? He looked it up. That's a price card? I did not look it up. I know the dark cards Wait. are in the GX it took, manga. It took you a minute, but no. You read the manga? Wait, what are the price card dark yes. lords? I thought the yeah, price card dark lords were... Yeah. were Superbia, uh, Superbia, Asmodeus, and Asmodeus, yeah. yeah. and Asmodeus right? Yeah. But Dark Lord Desire came out at the same time. I just wasn't sure if it was a prize card. Yeah, I'd be surprised if Ari was a Wait, is Dark Lord Desire a prize card? I didn't. I didn't know which one was a prize card. I, 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 I knew that those four came out at the same time, though. I don't think it's a prize card. Yeah, it, it's a three that Ben named, but Dark Lord Desire was not in there. Might be bright. Get your points back. <laughs> okay, because like that doesn't seem fair. Yeah, get your points back. <laughs> ben, go ahead. Uh, uh, old fashioned four hundred. Old fashioned four hundred. Originally released as a prize card, this is one of the oh few cards God. in the game with a mandatory negation. <laughs> This one I did check. Ben. This is a prize card. Ben. I know. What is Doom Caliber Knight? That is correct. The prize card? Doom Caliber Knight yeah, is originally a prize card. Yeah. We get the 200. Originally a prize card. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, this is the prize uh, card. Yeah, this is, are you sure this isn't a prize card? Prize card. It can't be special summon. Mm. Go ahead, Ben. Is there five of those? Um. 500, why not? Can be special summon? Originally debuted as a secret rare in 2007, this card was the cover card for an OCG structure deck never released in the TCG. Ben, I swear to god if you get this right, I don't want to play with you anymore. This is GX era, so... Or actually, did they get 5Ds before us? That never released in the TCG. I might know this, I'm thinking. Oh my god. still not released? Five seconds. like, end of GX start of 5Ds, probably. Two. Not enough information for me. This correct answer is Diablo's <clears throat> King of the Abyss. Oh, oh you guys didn't know that? Excuse you? Oh, you didn't know can, that. Can, 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 can <laughs> yeah, you can this guy out, Brian. Yeah, so the original. This card. This was, you want, this oh, was, you want me to kick Martino? Oh, don't do that. There was a fairy structure deck, and there was a. Um, and there was a. Like, All right, I mean, I'll, this, I'll this do was it. The, this was the original layer structure deck. <clears throat> Yeah. yeah, the original one. <laughs> this card, by the way, is unbelievably bad. Yeah, it's, it's really funny. But uh, it's got uh, modern sets. Go ahead, Ben. That's true. That's a good I'm point. surprised y'all didn't know that. Okay, okay. Uh, uh, two, 200. <laughs> Old fashioned for 200. Released as a secret rare in Galactic Overlord, this card saw a wide variety of. Sorry, I can't talk. This card saw use in a wide variety of decks that just needed a few extra cards. Brian. Card Cardi. That is correct. I don't know why I was thinking of Card Guard. <laughs> card Guard, dude. <laughs> I, was I was thinking Slushy. I don't know why. Then I was like, wait. Dude, I love Pretty Slushy. Go ahead, Brian. Right? Same. Mm -hmm. Let's say Hoven for 100. Hoven for 100. Come on. Call it title. <laughs> smash it. Smash it. This continuous spell is used to play in Mech Knight as a way to drop a Mech Knight summon. Martin. Oh. What is he? <laughs> what? <laughs> it was a trap. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Give me ten seconds. What's the question? Oh, they're telling me. Oh, they it's telling me. Just let me get back. You know, I play. Yeah, I also do. Oh, Five, it's um. Four. Five, three. Uh, 
two. I don't remember the name. One. <laughs> I know what it is though. It was a secret rare in something, right? It was a secret rare. He used an AB. Damn it, Ben. Fuck you, Ben. In point landing. That is correct. Yes, oh. that thing. Oh That's right. my God. He's that oh. an ABC. I remember that. I don't. I don't. It's an actual Go ahead. Go ahead, Ben. Yeah. Uh. uh you pluribus unum uh, 200. All right, what is this archetype? Mandrake, Nightshade, Holy Angel. Luis. I have no idea. Shit, I saw Mandrake. I thought, I thought it was going to be a part of plant, but I don't think that's it. Uh, I'll, I'll still guess. Oh, wait, oh, wait, you gotta guess which one doesn't belong, right? No, what is this no, archetype? What that archetype is. The archetype. Oh, okay, okay, okay. I think, I uh, think the I, last I'll, one's I'll... misspelled. Okay, uh, no, uh, I, I, I'll just say part of plant. That is incorrect. Heard of playing Holy Angel? Brian? Damn it! Is it Trickstar? That is correct. Nice. Is Holy it Holly Angel? Way. Yeah, I think it should be Ho uh, Holly Angel with two L's, <laughs> not Holy Angel, because that would never fly with uh, localization or censorship. Mm -hmm. Go ahead, Brian. Uh, Hoban 200. Forbidden for a brief period, this exceeds monster was critical to the fusion of the Kyle. Ding. Thank you, Emerald. That is correct. Hey, I think I think fast. Why are you? <laughs> <laughs> Go ahead, Kyle. I'll kick him. I'll uh, kick him. Revival spell for two hundred. No, I like the echo. It's fine. An old zombie revival spell. This card grants new life by taking it from your opponent's graveyard. Then. Spoke of life. That is correct. I clicked. I clicked in time. Mm. <laughs> I missed it. Uh. Revival spell, 300. Best known for its role in FTKs, this field spell trades plant monsters for a single monster in your graveyard. Ben. A field spell? What is Black Garden? That is correct. Yeah. Black Garden can revive a monster from the graveyard. I forget it, does Go ahead, Ben. How do you forget? That's like the whole point of the... Uh... Oh, Rival spell 400. Rival spell 400. Yeah. In the anime, this was an actual custom card that Pegasus made real. Oh, King Pegasus. Oh, it's gotta be GS. Ben. I, but I think. What it airs rock sunrise. That is correct. God damn it. Oh, wait, I can't say that oh. out word. Ben? <laughs> you said. Uh. Rival spell 500. Let's go play some games with Rabbi. Uh. Ben. What is Melfi hide and seek? That is incorrect. What's the question? Is it the other Melfi spell? Kyle. Melfi tag? That is correct. Yo, Ben jumped the landmine for me, thanks, man. <laughs> <laughs> and he's still, like, hella ahead. Go ahead, Kyle. Uh, revival spell for 100. There's plenty of time left. This is the sword <laughs> sword this game. Spell. <laughs> Kyle. You know, I'm gonna be honest, I don't know why I, I, don't know why I buzzed in. <laughs> there's one more word in this card, and I don't know it. It's Sword Soul Summit something or other. Give me the last seconds. 100. Just that, that, that's, 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 yeah. just give it the minus 100. Correct. Ding, 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 ding. Brian. Is a Sword Soul Sacred Summit? That is correct. <laughs> I just saw Sword Soul and clicked it because I figured I know what most of the cards say. You play this card? Go ahead, Sword Soul deck. I think you did. It's a one 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 one. <laughs> See, you got burned too, Kyle, on the 100. Uh, Hoban 300. This card received hype for a brief period when it was rumored Konami was increasing the starting life point total. Ben. What is Ancient Leaf? That is correct. Does, does the Ancient ben? Leaf let you draw two? Or is it yes, does. it does. I thought these were cards that only You got one play. card twice. No, uh... Fuck, you have to resolve it. Yeah. In tag duels, that card's a three of in every single deck. Unless you draw yes. two, right? I'm hey. not tripping. No, you are. You are. You're not. You're not. You're not. You're not. That is my mistake. You said they let you draw. What the fuck? <laughs> yeah, it, yeah, that was the problem. You were like, man, what is the card that has life points and draws one? Mm. <laughs> I was like, what? I mean, people used to hate it when I played a hero that doesn't pay 8,000 life points. Who asked? <laughs> <laughs>
Alright, so be so, so be advised, this this category can also include cards that let you draw two. I tried to look for okay. draw one. Before card of demise is in here. Card of demise is not in here. Card, card, card of sanctity. Card of sanctity is not in here either. Go ahead, Ben. Oh, well, let's see. Uh, Hoven four hundred. Just pot agreed. Of the counter traps that have effects that draw cards, this is the only one that lets you draw. Martin. Teller Nova Alpha. I'm sorry, one more time. So Teller Nova Alpha. Right? That is correct. I heard Teller Nova Alpha. Isn't it Stellar Nova it is Alpha? Stellar Nova Alpha. Go ahead, Martin. Possible so so plus against Saint Dark Bribe. So close to doing God, I need my own fucking archetype draw. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I knew it. Like, when I saw it draw, I'm like, okay, Martin better get this. I was like, wait a minute. Right, let's do Hoven 500. Let's <laughs> this card lets you draw if you use it for any kind of summon. Coming. Brian. Capshell? That is correct. Oh, that's nice. Right. Uh oh. If it's tributed, you draw. If it's used to for a ritual, if it's used for a synchro exceed or link summon, you draw. And if it's detached as some exceed material, you draw. What about a link summon? That's I, I he said just said it! <laughs> Go ahead, Brian. <laughs> Uh, what's E Pluribus again? I give you three Technically, cards. Technically, it doesn't include oh. itself when it summons. I give you three cards. You tell Dark, me their right, archetype. Yeah. Uh, okay. E Pluribus 100. Phoenix, Cerberus, Unicorn. <laughs> Luis. Dang. That's correct. By the way, guys, I was just like, <laughs> out, I was like, out for like the past five questions. <laughs> oh, oh man, he's, it. he's saying we, we, we have a head start. Go ahead, Luis. Uh, Alright, Nodo would have got that one. He was in him for 300. Crowley, Endymion, <laughs> Kyle. Uh, Magistus. That is correct. <laughs> Go ahead. I don't like this one. Irrational numbers right, for, I got 100. Them all now. for 100. This category's been killed. I, I just got them all now. Irrational really... numbers for 100. Number 101, that Silent one. Honor, <laughs> Kyle. I had a feeling this. Number C101, Silent Honor, Dark. That is correct. I pulled that piece of shit in my sneak peek. Yo, do you still have it? <laughs> oh, I got rid of it long. Oh, I need one. Uh, uh, 200. Need one? In the seventh one. Number in 69, right? Harold Dupress. Right? Number 69. Ben. Number C69, Harold Crest of Horror. That is correct. Okay, if you win like 40 bucks. Go ahead, Ben. Uh, lost in Transition, 300. <laughs> In Yu-Gi-Oh! GX, this card was originally a fusion monster, but was printed as an effect monster in Crossroads of Chaos. Ben. What is Neos Wise Man? That is correct. Ah. Uh -huh. yeah, Jaden the reading comprehension. Jaden needs a super polymerization to make <clears throat> this card. Really? Go ahead, Ben. Yeah. Because yeah, uh, uh, Night Shard uh, takes you, Bell. He oh. takes his waifu. <laughs> Go ahead, Ben. Uh, lost in transition for 400. In the anime, this card can be revived from the graveyard by discarding a trap card, thereby giving it an extra 1,000 attack points. Brian. Was it... Uh... Uriah, Lord of Searing Flames? That is correct. <clears throat> See, I, I was like, it's not Uriah, is it? I vaguely remember that effect happening. Go ahead, Brian. Uh, what about Irrational Numbers 300? Number 9, Dyson Sphere. Brian. Uh, number C9, Chaos Dyson Sphere? That is correct. If you look at the art on this card, it's fucking... You can literally weird. guess, like, <laughs> Chaos, Dark, Nightmare. <laughs> have, like, Go ahead, Brian. Some edgy point. shit on it. You can just pick one of the ones I know off the top of my head. There's only a few. Sorry, what was that, Luis? You didn't say C9, Cloud9. Hmm. Well, I didn't want to lose the points. <laughs> if there's 39, you have to give them all. The chaos number, uh, the chaos version of night of number nine Dyson Sphere is number C9 Mango. Yes. Uh, irrational numbers 400. Number 96, Darkness. <laughs> Kyle. Number 96, C96, Dark. I'm sorry. Number C96, Dark Storm. That is correct. Sorry, you cut out for a second. 
I had that card as a kid. I wanted to play it in my fucking agent deck, but I didn't know how to rank up and do it. <laughs> uh, <laughs> I, didn't have, I didn't understand how they worked. Uh, the 500 irrational numbers. Number 102, Star Seraph Sentry. Brian. I think it's number C102, Archfiend Seraph? That is correct. It is an RC card. Why wouldn't it count as an RC card? I mean, it could happen in a sec, this is not an RC card. <laughs> that would be weird. Uh, e Pluribus, 400. Leo, Basilisk, Unicorn. Luis. That's correct. Two Heraldic Beast questions. Kind of sus. Go ahead, Luis. Opening, Condemnation, Bond. Kyle. Branded? That is correct. Oh, okay. Branded con I've never heard of Branded Condemnation. Neither have I. <laughs> I only knew Branded <laughs> Opening and took a shot at it. I knew Branded uh, Bond. Old Fashioned for 100. This Thunder Monster sees, has seen some heavy side deck use as anti attack for normal summon. Ben. What is Danko Seca? That is correct. It's actually Danko Seca. Okay. <laughs> what was that YCS where the guy had like five back row, let it go through, and then he, he popped one and it was warning underneath? <laughs> <laughs> uh. And the judges were like, what the f? <laughs> no right there. Go ahead, Ben. Uh, Lost in Transition to 200. Lost in Transition 200. But known for its amazing flood and hand control effects in the TCG, this fusion monster didn't have an effect when it first revealed in its manga. Kyle. Fast Hero Dark Ball. That is correct. Oh, speaking of which, I have a question. Um, I don't know if I haven't bothered to read, but I figured some of you guys know. If you have a dark lock, can you still uh, perform? Um... Jesus Christ, what is the archetype name? Level threes and sixes that summon themselves by I mean, you can activate them, can... but you don't summon. Okay, so then Miguel cards. did get cheated against. He said like the guy still did it under dark lock. Yeah, you Bruh, can't. that guy's such. That guy is such a tool, and he doesn't know how his deck works. Yeah, anyway, you so you guys He's like uh, a guy, a guy that goes to our locals. He. Um, oh. He doesn't know how his own deck works. Uh, lost in Transition for 500. We'll do the hard one. In the manga, this Synchro card was a tuner monster, though that was removed in the TCG. So I see manga. no one reads the manga here. <laughs> Bet does. I only GX. I didn't read all of GX either. I read DM, but that everyone knows what happens in DM. So it's a synchro tuner. It's a synchro tuner. It's, it's not, not a synchro tuner. tuner. But it's well, I mean, not a, it's not a. It's synchro a synchro tuner, tuner in the manga, not in the TCG. Go ahead, Luis. Okay. Here it is again. I feel like the whole argument has a tuner, so it's TG in my brain. That is incorrect. Okay. I respect the guess. Mm. Do you respect it? Oh, that's a good guess. Five seconds. Correct answer is start a spark dragon. Oh, oh. that was a tuner. That was a tuner. Yeah. Did not know that. So level eight synchro tuner. Hmm. All right, and the last one lost in transition for one hundred. This card had special abilities that weren't even written on the card, such as instant attack and point-to-point -point transfer. Kyle. Wing dragon raw. That is correct. Were they really not written on the card, or were they just written in like Egyptian so no one could read them? Ka I think in yeah. in the dub, when Kai, when Kai was translating the Winged Dragon of Raw, he's like, it has effects that aren't even written on the card. No, nice. no that's crazy. <laughs> I think at one point, I think it's actually in the manga. I picture online where it's that duel where like Merrick's inside Bakura and Yai Merrick's like, oh, I'm gonna use an effect that he don't know. Bitch, it was your card. Mm. I mean, in the manga, the effect of, that is literally written on Ra is like, summon Ra and Ra's attack shall increase. <laughs> like, it doesn't is, say. <laughs> like, do manga... do? <laughs> <laughs> Ra just does whatever the writers need it to do. Yeah. 
This is your guys' favorite guy. Wait, anyway, so just, just in case you guys don't know, I let my cards have an effect that aren't really on the card. So. Nice. <laughs> you know that, did you know that Steemo's cards all effects right now that aren't on the card? That's the only explanation. So we're uh, going into Final Jeopardy now, right? Alright, moving into round two. Holy shit, I have more points than Ben's that rap before. I mean, this is, pretty, this is pretty even. Yeah, but <laughs> I'm gonna take the other shoe has drop at some point. All right. Yeah, you always shit on this second round, though. Going from left to right. Level we'll modulation. These are all cards that can increase or decrease levels. Oh, it's my favorite boy in that category. Um, oh read the fucking card. You all know this category. I'm gonna give you the effect of a card. You have to tell me what card it is. Uh, four kids. These are all Yu-Gi-Oh puns with TV shows. Insert the name of the card into the name of the show, almost otherwise specified. Western Privilege. These are all cards that were originally TCG exclusive. Uh, Solemn Brigade, I'm going to give you a archetype. You tell me it's Counter Trap. And Bounce House. These are all cards that return other cards to the hand. <coughs> so, Luis, you are in last place. The board is yours. Yay. Okay, let's go to level my division 400. This Beast Warrior was known in old formats for making Concellar Pleiades. <laughs> Luis. That is correct. Let's go! Let's go, Luis! You beat me too, Luis. I used to play that deck too. Uh, we'll go uh, four kids for 600. Blossom, Bubbles, and Buttercup make Onomatopoeia and rank fours in this classic Cartoon Network show. Ben. It's the Powerpuff Gaga Gaga -ga Girls. That is correct. Uh, I couldn't figure that one out for the life yeah. of me. That was pretty good. That's a good one. <clears throat> Go ahead, Ben. Uh, Western Privilege for 400. Originally part of a trio of fairies, later expanded to several rituals, this card receives the most use out of the original trio. <laughs> Kyle. I don't know why I buzzed in. Cyber Angel Benten. That is incorrect. What is this category again? These are all cards that were originally TCG exclusive. Martin. Oh. A Herald of Orange Light? That is correct. Because, mm. yeah, then we got the bitch ass Herald Ritual later. Go ahead, Martin. Uh, level Modulation 600. Level Modulation is something this spell can do, though it's better known for its searching and magical meltdown life protection effect. <laughs> Kyle. Dragon Fafnir? That is correct. Go ahead, Kyle. Level modulation for 200. Originally appearing in the manga, this fairy has been an important part of the meta since it's released in Lightning Overdrive. Kyle. Diviner of the Heralds? That Diviner of Heralds? Diviner of the Heralds. I said it right the first time. Okay, good. I thought this... for sure it was going to be Love Leader. I was so sad it wasn't. No, that was a manga card. Yeah, not yet. I first occurred the manga. You know, I think it was OCD it's the only structure. Part it's structure's manga. There's only like three oh, cards that matter okay. out of Lightning Overdrive. Go ahead, Kyle. Uh, read the fucking card for 600. If this face-up card is destroyed by battle, or leaves the field because of an opponent's card effect while its owner controls it, you can target one card in your graveyard, add it to your hand. Three, two, one. Hold up, give us like 10 more seconds. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, Five, kind of four, fast. three, two. I mean, you either know it one. or you don't. The correct answer is. I know this curious, part. the Light Sworn Dominion. Okay. So there's more than one card that does this. I've been seeing that card years. Don't, 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 like, but, no, but, you know, Victor always talks about it. Yeah, but like, no one ever summons it. Go ahead, Kyle. <laughs> oh, it is my turn. Uh, read the fucking card for 400. <laughs> Once per mm. turn, you can discard one spell. The monster special summoned by this card's effect gains attack and defense equal to its original attack and defense until the end of your opponent's turn. What? I don't even understand. Five seconds. Three, two, yeah, I have no, I have no, no idea. idea. The correct answer is brilliant fusion. What? Sure. Oh, that's right. That's right. 
Brilliant. Okay. The monster summoned with Brilliant Fusion has its attack and defense dropped to zero. So you just oh. discard a spell until you have it get its attack and defense back. I don't think I've ever seen that monster stay on the board for more than 10 seconds. Victory did that That's why it's a read the fucking card. Go ahead, Kyle. Let's make it easier. 200. We're going to get one of these, right? If the battle position of this card has changed, you can summon <laughs> one instead. <of> <laughs> Go ahead, Kyle. This card! I don't know it! It's number three, Cicada King! That is correct. Did you, was this in there before last night? Uh, no. <laughs> I, was make, I was making this last night. He was making Jeopardy as I was, like, like just solitary beat troopers last night. Go ahead, Kyle. <laughs> okay, uh, Western Pillage for 600. With the right setup, you can use this card's effect to search infinitely. Luis. Okay, I don't know if there's an exclusive, but this sounds like Infernity Park. That is incorrect. Okay. Not a bad guess, though. What's this category again? These are all cards that were originally TCG exclusive. Hmm. Ben. What is Treasure Panda? That is incorrect. You know, I was gonna guess Treasure Panda, but I didn't know if that was a TCG exclusive. Neither did I. I define I define I, I define TCG exclusive here as a card that was released in the OCG's extra pack because those usually have cards that originally appeared in the TCG. The correct answer yeah. is Gateway of the Six. Oh, oh. Hey, sure can. Oh, okay. Oh. Yeah. This yeah. card was a TCG <laughs> exclusive. I know that. Go ahead, uh, Kyle. Uh, Western Public for 800. This card was used to artificially extend the effect of a single chicken game. <laughs> Kyle. Pseudo space? That is correct. That was an exclusive for us? Oh, I didn't know that. I know that either. There it is. Right? Looking pretty good for Kyle. What, Kyle? Don't worry, this is all going downhill. We're gonna get to Ben's category sooner or later. He's wipe us. Bounce house for 400. <laughs> when Grinder Golem was legal, this secret rip from Circuit Break let you put it back in your hand to loop again. <laughs> Kyle. Pocket Sheet Magician? That's correct. Oh. Or does you play this in the Ruined Force FTK deck? Are you serious? So these yeah. The, um, a card that, that bounces cards? Yep, these are all cards that yeah. return cards yes. to the hand. <laughs> uh, bounce house for 600. This level 7 saw play in Blue Eyes. It's a monster to summon off Blue Eyes Spirit Dragon. <laughs> Brian. Uh, uh, I think it's Black Rose Moonlight Dragon. That is correct. Is that card still expensive right now? I don't know. Is it? I thought it, it got reprinted. I don't think it hasn't got reprinted in high speed promo, riders, right? has it? it? Got printed in high speed riders is super, but I don't know what happened to it after that. Go ahead, Brian. I don't I know. That was a manga promo, was it not? Originally, it was, yeah, I think. Originally. Okay. Uh. What did they get reprinted? Balance House 800. While its smaller level 8 counterpart is no more well known for its excellent <laughs> spot removal effect, Martin. Grab twin dragon. That is correct. How did you get that so fast? You play spread. <laughs> I saw eight and then I saw nine and I'm like, it's the only nine in the game. That I, I made it as far as level eight monsters. Wait, 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 wait. Nine no, that's a lie. No, no, there is. I missed think of a level nine synchro. Yeah, that's right. Go ahead, Martin. I saw eight and I saw nine and I said that's uh, a bounce house one thousand. <laughs> In the anime, this card was so formidable it caused Avion and Sparkman to form a guy pack. Ben. What is burst impact? That is incorrect. What does really? guy pack huh. even mean? I don't know. Oh shit, it's not. Oh, I got the word wrong. The second word wrong. Sorry. I'm apologizing for it. <laughs> Yeah, yeah. <laughs> you better be sorry. Hey man, get like, Jeopardy like questions wrong. On YouTube, Correct bro. answer is burst return. Burst return. What the heck is yeah, that? Yeah, this this episode was kind of. Need to look up this card. I don't even know what we're talking if about. If you have burst so, like, on the field, you return every other elemental hero to your hand. 
Yeah, like yeah, Avian and Spark guy Pack not taking thing. control. So basically, of, well, okay, so Avian. Yeah. In the dub, in the dub, Jaden uses this card against Blair. Blair has this monster that every any monster in battles you get to take control of. Uh, and the whole and like, the whole thing is like the monster falls in love with this with the character of uh, that character with the, with the other monsters it has, so it goes to the other side. And so Jaden summons Bersinatrix, activates first return. And, you know, like, it snatched Avion and Sparkling out of this, right? And they're like, what is I thinking? I don't want to get married. And then they look at each other and they go, Guy Pact, this didn't happen, okay? Yeah. Like, Fuck. <laughs> I, I did not know yeah, that. Yeah, Trix like, threatens them yeah, to like, come if, back to like, If you Jayden's don't get back in here, I'll tell the entire deck. Is that what she said? <laughs> That's what she said. It was so stupid. Hey, this is like, the worst speak. episode. <laughs> Hell? Yes, they speak in this This is like episode. the only time they speak. Uh, also, Avion and Sparkman had the same voices as Kaiba and Joey. Oh, I had, oh that, <laughs> that I did not know. Uh, and crazy. then I think for Stanatrix's voice in that one episode was uh, Amy from Sonic the Hedgehog. Wasn't the announcer guy from 5Ds a Goku? Yeah, he was. Really? The yep. guy with the pompadour? Yep. Huh. Uh, who got the last one? I think that was Martin. Martin, go ahead. Uh, or no one got the thousand? No, no one got first return. No. No! Oh, okay. Let's do Bounce House 200. This synchro monster is better known for Sword Soul for its ability to negate back row. Brian. Uh, Adamancipator. Mm. Is it. Risen Dragite? That is correct. I knew there was a word after, like in between Adam and Spider and Dragon. Drag yeah. Go ahead, bro. I, I didn't yeah, want to forget that thing bounces. Uh. Yeah, that card's actually ridiculous. Yeah. It's very good, yeah. I'll say level modulation 800. First appearing as a TCG exclusive, this card was integral to the original Wind Up Hand Loop, as it let you easily let you trigger multiple Wind Up Magicians. Kyle. You know, this is cheating again because I happened to be with you last night. So wind up shark. That is correct. It's shark. I, I, I was not a freaking wow. If you were up at Probably. 3 a.m., you would have heard that wind up shark was a TCG exclusive. I, uh, yeah, but I, I talked about wind up shark earlier than I do remember. I said, is wind up shark uh, uh, a shark card? Oh yeah. That's funny. Go ahead, Kyle. Uh, oh. Western privilege for 200. This was the seventh samurai of the original six. Ben. Was Grandmaster of the Six Samurai? That is correct. Make everyone else mad that there's like 46 samurais. No, yeah, I don't think there's six of them anymore. Like, they really need to, re really need to remake them. I think there are, what, 19? There are 19. What? No idea. There's like an X seed. Well, because, oh, well, okay. well, because there's, there's a Six Samurai. Isn't... There's a Six Samurai. That, that means... The Legendary Six Samurai, the Secret Six Samurai, and then there's Grandmaster. I'm not, I'm not counting like. Shadow of the Zit Samurai or Battle Shogun. I'm not counting those because they're not six samurai. Oh, okay, but they're not. They literally, but they literally are. Yeah, they're, they're no, not they're, well, they're part of the six samurai it's... archetype, but they're not like they're not samurai. Samurai. Uh, go ahead, uh, Ben. Yeah, you don't know fire with the Bushido called. Uh, uh, Western Privilege One Thousand. One of the most powerful cards of the modern age, the TCG exclusive didn't see play upon its initial release, despite being part of a format perfectly suited for it. This is way too big. Is this card still legal, PD? Perhaps. Wait, so these are TCG exclusives? They're all cards that were originally Maybe. TCG exclusive. Originally. I need a list of TCG exclusives. Ryan. Is it Dark Ruler No More? That is incorrect. What? Okay. Can we get like a, like what era you're talking about? That's very vague, man. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, it's a thousand points, and Ben is here. I still think we should get an era, though. If I give you an era, that gives it away. Alright. Well, he said modern age, so I thought it meant like. I don't well, know. but it probably came out before the modern age, because this card is good now. That is incorrect. He oh, hell? From, he hit the ground running, bro. <laughs> I looked this card up. No, it's, this no, is really cool, interesting. Cool. Uh, I was, I was really surprised. Okay, Peter, give us an era or give us a trap spell monster. Nah, cause they already got it wrong. I guess that. Correct answer. Probably is... another card I heard about at 3 a.m. 
Ben? Oh. What is tour guide from the underworld? That is incorrect. Yeah, there's no way. Tour guide. No way. No way it was tour guide. I don't know. I had to guess. Easy. The correct <laughs> answer is. I'm gonna end. Real Senshi. Wow. I'm so not gonna win it on this. Correct answer no is. Idea. Maxi. Uh -oh. What? It's banned! I just said it was legal! <laughs> I, I, mean, I, it's not I banned didn't, in the OCD. I didn't. You asked if it was legal. I didn't say it was or wasn't. Yeah, no. I didn't it's say if it was up, legal. Because I was like, I was thinking Maxi, but I'm like, it's fucking banned for us. So it's like, it doesn't mean it's not powerful. It is powerful. Who would have guessed Maxi, right? Would have thought like something was legal. You know, if I knew Maxi was a T suit exclusive, I might have guessed it. I didn't know it was a T-Suite exclusive. That's why, that's why it's a thousand points. You're, you're, okay. you're mad, okay. you're mad, you're what? mad that you didn't get, you're mad that you didn't know the answer to the question. Yeah. <laughs> and you're basically saying, you're saying, if I had, you're basically saying, if I had <laughs> no, known, no, no, if I had no, no, known no, no, no. the answer to the question, I would have got Let me finish. It. Yeah. You're, saying. you're pulling on my team right now, alright? I because, not... right, it didn't see play. I remember that was like one of the biggest things for about a year, and then people were like, like, this shit's actually Are the two more teams the same person? Yes. I don't know. At this Anyways, point, yes. Let's go play again. Go ahead. I believe we got the last one. I don't know. I don't know. It was, was it bad? bad? What was the last question? I think it was. Uh, last question was. No, not that one. Not that. Well, was, it was it 400? 200? Just someone pick. Who cares? Kyle. Kyle. No. It was Grandmaster. Okay. I think it was Kyle. No, I think it was Ben. Okay, ben ahead, said uh, that. Alright, Ben, go ahead. Grandmaster, right? Go ahead. Ben. Uh, four kids, eight hundred. Stupid continuous spell. You make me look bad. I cannot come up with what card you're talking about, Peter. I think that's the line. That's I, the line I, from the cartoon, right? Oh, I know the cartoon. I that's easy. I have no spell. idea what the card you're talking about. Ben. Banner of Courage, the Cowardly Dog. That is correct. What the fuck? Like, these are hard for me. Go ahead, Ben. Four kids, 1,000. This Cartoon Network classic tells the story of a furry mercenary who tries to get women to date him. Uh, 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 uh. Kyle? Johnny Bravo, fighter for hire. That is correct. Oh <laughs> my god. <laughs> I thought of Johnny Bravo, but I was like, free. Was it something I, like I, Kyle? I, <laughs> Wait, did you just do that just to trigger Kyle? With a oh, <laughs> A buddy of mine, I don't know if you, I don't know if you know Jeremy, he shows up locals like once a year. He plays for hires that have been played against him, like he's trying to get back into the game and he's really trying to make his work. Oh my and they god. Don't, but he's really me, trying. He's trying. Does he say oh, them like on the card text? He's like, I'm gonna add a card for hire to my Oh yeah, hundred percent. He knows it makes him mad. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good Oh, one of the few decks in the game that loses a scary bot that has no out for it too. Uh four kids for two hundred. <laughs> In this Adult Swim comedy show, this pendulum monster and her grandson are all about that McDonald's Szechuan sauce. I think this was Adult Swim. No, you know, you're the, the, you're, you're the TV show. Ben? What is Archfiend, Eccentric, and Morty? That is correct. Oh my god. That should have been more than 200. What the hell? <laughs> oh, holy shit. That should have been 1,000 right there. Yeah. yeah. I just put I just put in Rick and Arcane etc. Kills. I'll go with that one. Oh, sure. sure. How did you even be his grandson? Because uh, Arch Phoenix etc. I think is a, I think is female. Uh oh, definitely is female. Have you it seen is. that card? Okay. Go ahead, Ben. Uh, four hundred. Four kids, four hundred. Kaiba tails, Kaiba tails. It's almost time for Kaiba tails. Come along and take my hand. Let's all go to Kaiba land. Kyle. Blue eyes, white dragon tails. That is correct. How is that not the two hundred? <laughs> My Classic. Go ahead, Kyle. I figured you guys knew Rick and Morty oh. more than you knew dragon tails. 
Dude, but Dragon Arch Phoenix Phoenix eccentric. Shit you're, like, the, you're the difference between knowing really... Arch Phoenix eccentric and knowing Blue Eyes. <laughs> uh, level modulation for a thousand. Let this be my boy for some reason. This is the other non-hero related quick play spell. Elemental Hero Shadow Mist can search. The non-hero of... Martin. Uh, form change? That is incorrect. It's not here. There, there's a random card, Shadow Mist. Okay, so Shadow Mist can search what? It's, oh, it's a mass it quick is play good. spell. It searches a change. Or change, change. Change quick play spell. I had that wrong. Oh. There's one random card it can search. Luis. Level change. That is incorrect. <laughs> Imagine if that was right, though. Although, that admittedly, admittedly, that is closer than you think. Oh, wow. Okay. Level change down. Three, <laughs> two, two, one. <laughs> Correct answer is. Oh, I don't know. Star Changer. A fuck? How? <laughs> that was. Okay. Oh! I've never heard of this. Guy. Level, star. I mean, that's pretty close. Uh, Go ahead, Kyle. What card uh, did you think I was going to put? Card for 800, obviously. Oh, no, I just, no, I knew what you were talking about. I said it was called. Oh, so what card, I remember what, I was, I what, what, card did, what card did you think I was going to have? You were talking about your boy. Oh, level leader. Oh. <laughs> Target level, one Shadal level leader, monster my boy. in your graveyard, special summon it in face up or face down defense position. <laughs> ben. Uh, what is Shadal Falco? That is incorrect. Falco only does face down. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I didn't read it. <laughs> I gotta read a different card to get this one. Um. Oh, that's fuck. Wait, oh, what? Oh my god. Wait, what targets? Uh, Luis. Uh, fuck. Oh, never mind. You know what? It... Oh, no, okay. I know what it is. I know I what it is. I, I know the card, but I don't think I'm actually the right name. It's called Shadal Reincarnation. That is close. That is incorrect. Oh, so Reshadal yeah, Resh Resh Reincarnation. No. <laughs> That's can't count also that Kyle? Okay. Resh Shadal Incarnation? That is correct. God damn it. That's the, That's the primary effect of that card! Yeah. yeah what? Yeah. yeah How do people not know that? People you had me confused. I was like going through all Shadal cards. People I'm like, use the graveyard effect because, of because this Because card, the one though. that you use no. the most is the one that you flip battle positions. You don't, you, you don't really oh, use that's when you summon. That's the one you use the most. No, but like if you dead draw, it's like well at least. You I use that card. That, like, that, I used the card just to win in control matchups. It's really hype because you could loop construct infinitely. Go ahead, Kyle. Yeah. Uh, read the fucking card for a thousand. Once per turn, quick effect. You can remove three kaiju counters from anywhere on the field. Attack and defense. All of the monsters on the field become halved. Ben. What is Gadarla, the mystery dust kaiju? That's correct. I'm impressed. You know that. I think I know. Most of the kaiju's effects. All right, I only have that radiant. I love how Gamma radiant seals summons like token. Uh, Gamma seals good. <laughs> Gamma seals an omni negate. Jesus cure negates stuff that targets. Oh, Gamma seal attacks cannot negate another Gamma seal. Which I think That's true. He's still a Doggeron did. Doggeron blows up all the monsters in the field except itself, right? So you, you are an encyclopedia. You know that. Uh. Go ahead, Ben. Oh, you have I, I like the kaijus a lot. So I've read that. Jesus is a, the Jesus of Regeki, right? No, Jizukiru negates stuff that targets itself. Then the no, three targets targets, dragon targets a card anywhere. Times, right? Targets any card? Interesting. Yeah. You can negate things that target banished cards, and you can target the graveyard. Kumongus hmm. is lose one turn, I think. Holy shit. Yeah. yeah. You remove two, the monster, I think, can't attack. Effects are negated. That's <laughs> No, it just skips an extra. You literally lose one turn. Go ahead. Okay. Then. Which Psalm are you doing? A kaiju that does that. Which Psalm are we starting with? Like I left the Psalm Brigade. Uh, uh, Six hundred. These are. I'm going to give you an archetype. You tell me it's counter trap. I'm not gonna get these. The eight hundred. You're gonna be like Earthbound what? That's a counter trap. No idea. Right. Like what? <laughs> <Let's come laughs> ben. <laughs> ben's the only one who would ever possibly know this. It had a counter trap? I don't think I know these. Isn't it? I don't know. Like, didn't it come out too long ago? No. Yeah. Probably. Earth Battle has got a lot of support recently. Well, somebody was ago. playing Weira Coach Roska in a Fluandries deck oh, that I saw. I think I know it. Nice. Go ahead, Brian. Is it Earthbound Wave? That is correct. Nice. 
Thank you, oh, Duel Links. Judge. No, it's Duel Links. Earthbound Immortals are played in Duel Links? What the hell? Well, I remember earning those Earthbound cards, so I was like, ah, uh, sucks. Go ahead, Brian. What is this card? <laughs> uh, Solemn Brigade 800. Assault mode. Come on, Brian, you played these cards. I'm thinking. Uh, I vaguely remember. I'm thinking of the name. It's also new, right? Is it not? Oh, I think it's Alpheus. Like, I think, yeah. I think it's Assault Counter. That is correct. And I think the monster on that art isn't even an Assault Mode. Monster. No, I think it's the Chthonian Dragon. Stark right? Blaze Dragon, I think. Go ahead, what? Brian. No, why, I'm pretty sure why the Chthonian. Is that on... Why? I don't know. Go ahead, Brian. <laughs> okay. Uh... One thousand. Although it would make sense if yep. it was just throwing an Ember Dragon. This is the one that no one's gonna know. Kawaki Mirror. Two answers are accepted. Do we have to say two? Oh, I, I said no. You only have to say one. Two answers are accepted. Okay. Go ahead then. What is Kawaki Mirror Negaton panel? I'll give you a chance to rephrase your answer. Uh, not sure if I core Negaton panel. That is incorrect. Okay, yeah. Some point Negaton panel. I think it is... Well... I think it's... Negaton core panel? That is correct. You also... I also would have said Iron Core Luster. I have not heard of Iron Core Luster. I think I get to spell I haven't heard of any of these cards. Go ahead, Brian. Uh, Solar Brigade 400. Flambell. Martin, this is you! I actually don't know many of the cards. Oh, I just kind of associate with fire archetypes. I'm just gonna go for it. Go for it! I'm going for it. Brian? <laughs> Do I get it? Yeah, Brian. Glamville counter? That's correct. Nice. I don't care what the 200 it is, I'm just saying counter now. <laughs> <laughs> well, it doesn't matter what the archetype is. 200. <laughs> Final one, Solemn Brigade for 200. Floanderies. Kyle. Okay, actually, it's like... I actually know this one. It's like Flunderies of the Stormy Seas. Uh, I'll give you a chance to rephrase your answer. And the Stormy Counter. <laughs> uh, oh, you're right. Uh, Flunderies of the Scary Seas. That is correct. Oh, wow. I love this card's, like, quote-unquote drawback. Oh, oh, this is, this is my favorite oh, no. fucking it's Darth, card. I love it. It's Darth again. All right. We are oh, now sorry. moving into Final Jeopardy. I was before you answer, I will show you the category. Your category is Unsung Heroes. Well, boys, it was nice having the most points. Time to go down to zero. Brian, how many how many points would you all like to wager? All of them. Wait, hold up, hold up, hold up. Is Martina gonna wager all his points? Fuck no, dude. One point. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'd like I'll to change. Ask, I'll ask you to to pay an increase. But if Martin wins, he gets oh, the TCG oh, player of failure. No, that's why I'm trying to win. <laughs> yeah, we have to let him. We Never have to let I, him I, do I it. Wanna, I want to wager. <laughs> seventy-two minus six country. You need seventy-two uh, minus six. six. <laughs> Give me a moment. I want to wager the amount of points so Martin can't win. You have to wager. You can do half, and I still can't like win. Even if you were to, you have you would have to wager sixty five. Uh, I'm not, six, I'm not six, doing that. You have to wager sixty five hundred, I think. Oh, I ain't no bitch though. Okay. I just think it'd be funny. So Ben, how many points are you wagering? Plus now I get to. I'll wager five hundred. All right. Plus now I get to make fun of Martin for not wagering all his points. All right. So this is actually the first time I've seen someone not wager their points. <laughs> Right, you so here Luis, for it, ben. If, if uh, I win, I get Peter's permission to use his YouTube channel to get an affiliate link for TCG Player. Because someone's gonna click on it. Yes. All right. So Luis, Trust. Uh, uh, with yours, you with yours, if it. you put it to zero, uh, is it you get it right? I'll put your points to zero. If you get it wrong, I will double them. They're gonna click on Peter. What a Peter song to be like. Oh yeah, I need to order a card. TCG Player. Your cat. Your exactly. question from the awesome. category unsung heroes. This man lent his name to Yugi's Egyptian God card.
know, on Jeopardy, I'm relatively certain they accept last names. I am, I am looking for this man's full name. <laughs> well, you know. You may win this after all, but we'll see. If, if, <laughs> if, uh, if Peter doesn't accept my answer, he's biased and wrong. <laughs> That's all I'm gonna say. If anyone actually knows this, good for you. I'm not 100% on my answer. Yes. Thank you. I didn't actually know, like, this piece of trivia until, like, like relatively recently. We were talking like, about it the other day, weren't we? We were, that's like cards the... that were named after people. Yeah, that... I'm looking for this band. Yeah, we were. I think it came up because of the last. last. That is his. That is his full. That is his full name, Peter. <laughs> his name is is. Uh, is, is his full name. His name is uh, uh, Bob Osiris. Mm. Ah, dude, All his right. name is Doug Bowser. Yes. Luis, what is your answer? I'm sorry, Bowser Slifer. He's got a really cool last name, by the way. Just, just off topic. His last name was kind of sick. Yeah, it's like, bro. I wish, I wish I had that last name. <laughs> My last name is Obelisk. Luis, what is Luis? What is your answer? Is Luis here? Hello. Luis. Did Luis, did, was, did Luis even technically wager points? I didn't ever oh. hear him say anything. Well. The way I do it is if you're in the negatives, you have no points to wager. So if you get it right, I'll double them to zero. If you get it wrong, I will double them uh, negatively. Nice. Yeah. So for, if you have negative points, it is automatically double or nothing. Well, Luis, if Luis knows the right answer, he wins. Just later on, if he comes back, it's like, oh, yeah, his the name is Obelisk awesome. of Takahashi. All right. <laughs> uh, uh, raw? Luis? <laughs> Luis, I don't think is here, so... I'm just gonna move on then. All right, so your final Jeopardy question: This man lent his name to Yugi's Egyptian god. Starting from the bottom, Luis has submitted no answer. That is incorrect. Uh, Brian and Martin, sorry, not Brian. Ben and Martin, you are tied for you are tied for fourth, third place with 500 points. Ben, you said Roger Slifer, and Martin, you said Mr. Godam's D's nuts. That is incorrect, Martin. <laughs> Wait, no, that's incorrect, Ben. Ben, that is the correct answer. No way. It is. I'm pretty sure it's got on these nuts. Why though? Why do you know everything, Ben? You literally well, Brian, know everything. You go, Brian, well, you everything. are in second, I have a thousand Brian, points. You are in second place with 4,200 points. You said Roger D's nuts, Slifer. That is correct. You even got his nice. full full name. <laughs> you even got his middle name too. And it's possible yeah, that that's like them. his nickname. And is Kyle, you are in first place. You had Slifer, the executive producer. That is incorrect. Nope, you're wrong. That's his name. Is he actually a producer? He was an executive so. producer. That's why it's. That's why in the yeah, original series it is Slifer, the executive joke. producer. But his name yeah, that's, was that's Roger his, Slifer. That's his, that's the whole meme. He's Slifer, the executive producer. I knew they called him that because it was named after a guy. I didn't know if he was actually an executive producer. See, though. I didn't know it was named after a guy. I thought that was just some joke that went over my head, which it obviously was. But <laughs> and, then, and then I learned. I was like, oh, that's not that funny. All right. Well, congratulations uh, well, to Brian. Can I transfer my points to Martin? No. <laughs> Why not? Wait, can I use my privilege of winning to give Martin a DCG player affiliate link? Then use your own YouTube channel, not mine. Well, but this is my YouTube channel. What are you talking about? Shut up. Well, that does it for this round of Yu-Gi-Oh! Jeopardy. Uh, oh my the, god. For the I'm trolling uh, myself. Jesus. And uh, thank you all for participating. Uh, thank you all for participating. Do you have any final words you'd like to say? I'd like to say that when posed, the, when asked the question, can gods bleed? The answer is yes. Is it what?